There it is, Vault 75. This is where a lot of gunners retreated to after the sheriff. Well, you'll probably hear that story one day. <laughs> it's been a while, but they might have a bone to pick with anyone wearing our colors, so I've made it a point to avoid it. Let me get that signal jammer up. I know gunners, and the moment the shit hits the fan, they'll be radioing for help. We can't let them get word out that we're on to them or something might happen to Lily. You get your pit boy from a vault? Have you ever noticed no one ever opens those metal vault tech containers? Isn't that weird they're all still sealed two centuries later? Downright suspicious if you ask me. I'm gonna have to send our scavengers and riggers out here to clean the place out once the wet work is done. All right, lock and load. Let's get in there and pick up Lily's trail. Plenty of time to talk later if we're still alive. Let's keep on mission objective. Lily's counting on us.
Plenty of time to talk later if we're still alive. Let's keep on mission objective. What? All right, this has to be go, the place. Go, go. We gotta move fast. He's probably already figured out he's being jammed. the transmitter power. Stay there, guys. Needed to question him. Let's hope that terminal's got something or we're gonna have to go track down this colonel he was screaming at. <clears throat> well, so much for this O'Brien guy. Needed to question him. Let's hope that terminal's got something or we're gonna have to go track down this colonel he was screaming at. Looks like Lenny was right. The Institute wanted Lily. Well, they wanted the FSD and they wanted to chew her brain to get to us at least. Says here they took her to an off-site counter-ops location for memory extraction to get more info on the department. Ginger here sent out a squad to kidnap DP and the doctor for the Institute the next time they were outside the walls. And bingo. The dumb f typed out right where it was here. We got the spot they're keeping Lily. Some gunners, I swear. And there's other stuff here. He mentions the Sheriff's Department and a plan against Diamond City. And shit. This is a treasure trove of intel. Better put this on the holotape and bring it back. I'd say we got the Institute's attention to get this kind of special treatment, though. 
All right, you heard the sheriff. Tom is our enemy here. We have to hot-foot it over to this counter-ops and ventilate everything that moves until we reach Lily. Let me know when you're ready to go. Travel light, because we're moving fast. <clears throat> Did we get going yet? Lily's counting on us. So is the bleachers. All right, all right. I hope you're not a smoker, because you're going to need those lungs. Let's move out. a facility in this place? You gotta be kidding me. Ugh, Queen the Rook, we found the garden. Trying to pick us a flower now. Keep the coffee on. We're on Institute turf now. Get those guns up. Remember our orders. Everything in there, not Lily, dies. We have a reputation to uphold. inside an institute facility before. And this is the moment of truth. Oops. Those fucking courses bleed just like us. I'm in plain sight. It may do. Let's go slow. Gotta do it. Ninja style.
There she is. Lily. Look what those just did to her. She's barely conscious. There she is. Lily. She's barely conscious. Is this her blood? I'm gonna kill all those institute fuckers myself. All of them are dead. Lily? Hey, Lily! Let's get this door open fast. Find the terminal that controls this. Lily! Hold on, we're coming. Just, just. Hold on! We just get back to Diamond City first. Hey, good to see you again. Thanks for coming. But see you again. Thanks for coming. But can we just get back to Diamond City? <laughs> Hey there. Hey! Double time it, Lily. I left the mini nuke downstairs. This elevator door isn't going to be open much longer. One last mini nuke on me, motherfuckers. Guys, this detonator synced with the one downstairs. So we got to get the fuck out of here. Now. Going up. We got no time to waste. We gotta get back to the department. I know you're banged up, girl, but we gotta keep it together just a little more. Let's get out of here before more of them shows up out of nowhere. I don't know, Crenshaw. Ugh, those stim packs are starting to wear off. I could barely make it up the elevator. How am I getting to Diamond City? Here, use this jet. No arguments. We need to straighten you out and get you home fast. Right now is what the shit's actually meant for. Oh, God. Between this and your morphine, I could die and I wouldn't realize it for three days. Mm, okay. <sighs> okay. Guys, we gotta get home before this wears off and you have to carry me the rest of the way. 
Now I have to talk to the sheriff. She's got to hear about what I saw in there. She most certainly does, and don't you worry about that. I ain't stopped recording telemetry since we came to get you. Now, first things first, take this shotgun. Let's go. We got to get you home fast before any more of these toasters pop in. On your feet, Adam Cat. Rook, this is Queen. Well, FSD-1, we got one very badly damaged flower, but it's still alive, heading north to Safe House C. Gonna need med surge on arrival. Confirm. Okay, let's get you back to the department. Gary will be waiting for you. Excuse me. Hey, good to see you again. Hey, thanks for coming. Excellent work out but there, both of you. This can was we no just small get back feat, to Diamond City especially first. in the short time frame you pulled it off? With all due respect, what I saw out there needs to be addressed immediately, sir. It's about the Institute, and they can't wait. I've got a mission's worth of telemetry, two hollow tapes, and a debriefing full of actionable intel. Certainly, Crenshaw. Let me tend to Lily's friend here, and we'll head straight to Lieutenant Dan and my terminal. You. I suppose you've earned serious consideration for Green Zone clearance. I will speak to my officers and Lily about it. However, it's customary for anyone newly cleared to receive an orientation to learn the rules and boundaries. To that end, go see Dr. McClintock in her greenhouse once we are more confident of Lily's prognosis. I will send word to expect you. If my officers don't have any objections, I will have her give you the orientation. Show up early in the morning, so you can be introduced to the on-duty officers. Gary is a very talented surgeon. He has saved many patients that the other doctors in the Wasteland would have otherwise lost or killed themselves. Considering she managed to get here on her own two feet, I anticipate she'll make a quick recovery. Physically, at least. It seems Lily chose her friends well. Nevertheless, here are the caps you were told you'd be paid. Now, if you'll excuse me, the lieutenant and I have a lot to discuss.